Well, this YouTube clip will discuss a web service called shoplift.ai. The title is the first A-B testing app that integrates with your Shopify. So A-B testing stands for split testing. So it's basically optimizing, trying different content, call to action, images, and see what performs the best. So Shoplift is a data-driven, no-code, A-B testing app designed specifically for Shopify merchants. It allows users to boost sales rates and improve templates by automatically styling blocks and parts to make their brand. And this is what Ava is going to talk about in a couple of minutes. Before we watch that video with this web service, there is a crucial point I would like to share with you. It's a story about the necessity to persist and never surrender. I recently heard a speaker talking about how she created a popular social media channel. Her approach for starting a new channel was enlightening and I think it can help all of us with our own efforts. She stressed how important it is to do thorough research and knowing what kind of content works well in the present environment. By writing down ideas, studying popular channels, she learned a lot. Then she experimented with different video forums, captions and hashtags without being afraid to see what works best with her viewers. The most important thing I learned was how important it is to provide worth and authentically engage with the audience. It is not merely about chasing likes or achieving viral fame. It is also about making important connections with others and offering others something useful. Consider how excited she must have been when going back to her channel after taking a break. She had to leave it for a while because she needed to pay attention to other parts of her life. But she stuck to her promise to herself because she knew the right time would arrive. And when she came back, she did so with new energy and a refreshed perspective. While she found a method that was beginning to work for her, a system that helped her utilize her knowledge more effectively and produce content faster. And the results were amazing. Within three months of her comeback, she gained more than 20,000 people following her on her new account. Her perseverance and persistence were truly paying off. So I have something that might interest you. And this is a free educational video on digital marketing. So I share useful tips and there is no sales pitches. Stay until the end and I will share how you can access this video training. Anyway, I will introduce you to Eva that will present this service. So over to you, Eva. Thank you, Anders. With the first data-driven, no-code A-B testing app made for Shopify, you can boost your sales rates and make your templates even better. Shoplift is the only app that lets you go beyond your theme by automatically styling blocks and parts to match your brand. Hey guys! First time, maker, here. We can't wait to finally show you Shoplift. So many of you have told us the same thing. You're annoyed that the A-B testing tools on the market don't work well with Shopify, and you're tired of having to work with engineers to get the tests you want up and running. We always hear this. That's why we made Shoplift, the first data-driven A-B testing tool that doesn't require any coding and was made just for Shopify merchants. Thank you to everyone who has been with us on this trip. We've been blown away by how well Shoplift has been received, and we've been working hard to add all of your great suggestions. Welcome to those who are new to Shoplift. We're dying to know what you think. Some background for those who don't know. 8B testing has been around for a long time, but if you're a Shopify merchant who has tried using other 8B testing tools, you know how frustrating it can be to try to start the test you want. Traditionally, there have been two types of tools, those that require you to use their own platform to build a whole new page to test, and those that only let you use a WYSIWYG editor to change a version of your current page. The problem with the first is that you can't separate the variable you're testing because you're changing too many things at once. 
The problem with the latter is that their WYSIWYG editors don't let you test anything more serious than a button or copy change without the help of a developer. Because they want to work on every platform, these other tools are very restricted. Theft from a store is different. By making a testing app just for Shopify merchants, we can give customers a lot more power and control than they would get on any other testing platform. But that was only the start. We also added a new tool called Lift Assist TM, which suggests tests based on your store's style and the styles of your brand. We hope you like it. Have a good test. All right. Over to you, Anders. Thanks for sharing this with us, Eva. So allow me to explain something I think many people don't comprehend. The majority of online content creates the impression that becoming successful online is quick and simple. Why is that? It makes sense to me that this is the case since it only serves to entice customers to make purchases. Before I started my journey as an influencer, I was trapped in that kind of cycle. I invested time and money on crap and I never had a real direction. Now I understand that this is something that will take time. The problem is that people give up way too quickly. It's comparable to wanting to lose weight. When you don't lose weight quickly, are you just going to give up or are you going to figure out what you can change? I have to upload videos on a consistent basis and gradually test different things. Recently I invested in this video system that I use for this video. By the way, fantastic tool. However, I gradually need to figure out the things that get me results. I learn from it and then I share it with you guys. Now under this video in the description box you have a link that will take you to my landing page. And on this landing page, you can access my free video training. If you don't want to sign up for my free video training, there is a red button on that page that will take you to one of the landing pages for the system I use. There you have the opportunity to sign up for the high ticket platform. You will also get help from a personal coach. Honestly, this is not a typical affiliate product. It is a full digital training portal with coaches and high ticket products that are there to guide you and all the people you refer to that system. The high ticket products pay out more than a thousand dollars in most cases. But this happens when you start to get momentum in your business. As a beginner, you will see the low ticket commissions more often before the high ticket earnings. Anyway, I'm glad you watched this video. I do appreciate that you took some time to listen to what I wanted to share. If you learned something of value, then do click the like button. This will help my YouTube channel get more visibility. Also, if you want to see more videos like this, then click subscribe and hit the bell notification so that you don't miss any of my new videos. Take care, stay safe, and I will see you in my next video. Bye bye.